For chocolate dipped strawberries, we're going to use the same prepared compound coating as the cake pops. Here's some tips and tricks for strawberries. First things first, make sure your berries have a slight chill on them. So put them in the cooler before you plan on dipping. The second thing you're going to do for strawberry success, and this may sound icky, but stay with me, do not wash them. I know, I know, it's the wrong thing to say, but anytime you put any water on these beautiful berries, it's going to make it almost impossible for the chocolate to set up correctly. It kills the food sanitary in me. What I'm gonna say is, just wipe the berries off very gently with a towel and place them in the cooler. Next, if you notice the way I'm dipping in and out and in and out very quickly, this is called the dipping motion. What it does is it allows the chocolate in the bowl to slowly pull the excess off the berry. And then if you notice, once I place them on the pan, there's no feet. Feet are the spot where the chocolate pulls down around it. When dipping things in chocolate, you don't want a lot of feet. So using that dipping motion will help. The next thing that helps is using the smallest possible bowl for the amount of chocolate you have. You want to be able to completely submerge the product and not have a lot of bowl for the chocolate to get thin or set up around the edges. If you start to dip and dip and dip and your bowl starts to become empty, you're going to tip it up on the side to keep all the chocolate on one spot. Cool it in the bowl.